these are just the lines to buy tickets out here. Uh-oh. It is about 9 o'clock and they've been letting people in and these are the lines. 9 a.m. crowds. It was very crazy outside, but let's go see what Mini Mickey's is like. Good morning, everyone. We're back. This is Hollywood Studios. It is Saturday of Labor Day weekend, so not expecting to stay here alone. But woke up this morning because Dad has not gone on Rise yet, and I got Rise of the Resistance Group 3, so I'm really, really good at getting it, I guess. Uh, last time was Group 2, this time it's Group 3, and the other time, like, I got it late because it was just still open at 7.30, so that one doesn't really count. But this one went immediately because I was like, dang, I got three. So I went to go see if I could like get a later group because everyone was still sleeping again, but it was gone within seconds. So I'm good at getting it. What can I say? So we're really here to ride that and then we'll see. Right now we're heading to Mickey and Minnie to see if we can get on it because that hasn't done that yet. Minnie and Mickey says it's a 20 minute wait. The wait is outside, uh, but our rise was called. So we are gonna head over to Rise because it just opened and it seemed like it wasn't delayed. So we're hoping the pre-shows are working so Dad can see the pre-shows. And so we're just gonna head over there. Um, me, Mom, and Dad will be back here during the week to do Minnie and Mickey's. Or we'll check back later. So while everyone else runs throughout the park, you get over to Muppet Vision and it's empty. So our boarding group got called right at 9 a.m. when the park opened. We are group three, so we have till 10 a.m. To, oh, to ride it. We got here, we've been here for a little bit now, and Chris and Eugene and Bradley were behind us, and they got to parking at 9.05, and it is now 9.25, and they just got through. And now they have to park, walk, get through the front, and get back here. So we have until 10 o'clock, so we shall see. Otherwise, me, mom, and dad are gonna go do it and then they can ask and see if they can ride after. People said that you're able to, especially if you say like, I've been, like, here's a picture, I was in parking since nine o'clock. So, we'll see. It is 9.40, they have made it in, so we are headed to our rides. Hope everything's working so Dad can get the full experience. He actually likes Star Wars, unlike me who knows nothing about it. So, I really hope everything's working for him. It went up right away, so I'm thinking it is. Thanks for joining the cause. A covert resistance team led by my friend Finn has infiltrated a First Order Star Destroyer that is now headed to this system. Your outpost on Batu is no longer safe. We have transports waiting to take you to General Organa's secret base on Pakara. I'll regroup with you there. The resistance desperately needs your help in our fight against Kylo Ren and the First Order. Affirmative. Transport is ready. Nine on the I shall personally see them delivered. Thank you, Lieutenant. Welcome to the cause. May the Force be with us. Commander Poe Tanner and a squadron of X-Wings shall escort us to the rendezvous point on Bakara. Roger, this is Black Leader. I hear you're a fine-looking group of recruits. Well, no time to waste. Let's get you on your way to the General. All ships launch. I have been tasked with getting you to Bakara. Red 2, Blue 5, keep tight now. Let's get ready to make that jump to light speed on my mark. Black Leader, we're picking up an unusual signal. Are you spotting anything? Yeah, I see. Leave us. Yes, General. Enemies of the First Order, we will soon snap out your meager resistance. You chose the wrong side, and now you will pay. The resistance business. You have what I want. It's about you. Hurry and don't be caught. Recruits, for your safety. What did you think? I cried a little. It was so good. No, it was good. The mechanics of it, the, the unmanned uh, ride vehicle, the pre shot. It was great. great. Two thumbs up. As always, Muppet Vision has to be our next. Rowley Axis. Oh. 
stop the projector! So it, it is 11 o'clock on the Saturday, Labor Day weekend. So definitely the most crowded day we have had so far. Tower of Terror has been 13 minutes while we have been here and today it is at 40. They even have the extended queue ready to go. We are sitting right by the exit of Tower. It's the best spot. And there's a Joffrey's right here. No, and you have seats right here. Don't tell people about our spot. <laughs> and mom got, I don't know what this is, chocolate. Double chocolate double muffin. Double chocolate muffin. And it's giant. Yeah, that's a good one. I got a clear bottle of water. Yeah, he paid for water. What the? Me and mom. We get, get the free ice. And then I stopped for popcorn. We are heading into Walt Disney Presents, One Man's Dream. into the Monsters Inc. experience. Ooh. So this is where you used to meet the, the gang, but not doing it right now, but this is a very good picture spot. You could just take one of yourself. The second room where you used to meet them has a booze door. Just did one man's dream, and me and dad have to always hit sit. Front row center, that's our, our favorite show. Uh, so we always have to get those seats. And it's just a great show. Like a lot of people like are like, what is this? And then they leave when they find out. Like if you're coming to Disney, you gotta know about about it. Like I don't know, I love it so much. I get a little tear out every time I watch it. It's awesome. And we used to always have to get front row center in the Lion King show in Epcot and Land, but I don't remember what it was called. But when they like talked about the planet and stuff. But they took that away. I was not happy about it. So we still have to go see that new show. We haven't seen it yet. So I'll still sit front row center. We'll see how we like that one. But we are heading out. It is very, 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 very crowded today. Uh, so we just came for rise, then just like hung out and did Muppets and One Man's Dream because there's never waits for those. And we have a brunch reservation at Olivia, so we're heading over there now. Antique store, right when you walk in, they do have a photo pass section. We did that in Disney Spring once, and it was really great. There was no one in there, we took like a thousand pictures, and it was awesome. So go check it out if you have photo pass. I'll insert some of the pictures, if I can find them. The line for guest relations if you need it before entering the park and these are the lines just to buy tickets still and it's already 12 o'clock we have made it to disney's old key west we have brunch reservations bugging me for the past two weeks for eggs. Got you eggs, bro. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> he got the Olivia's, which is eggs anyway, bacon or sausage or ham, uh, potatoes, creamy, and a biscuit. Mom got the banana crunch toast. He picked bacon. Came with two slices, I already ate one. I got the waffles, and it's supposed to come with eggs anyway, but I do not like eggs at restaurants. So she said I could either get another waffle or the potatoes. So I got the potatoes. And I'm so excited for finally getting Mickey waffles. Breakfast was very good. Uh, very simple breakfast. Uh, normal things. I just got Mickey waffles and the potatoes, which was good because I don't like eggs. Dad got, finally got his fried eggs. He's very excited. 
Um, Mom got the banana toast. And it was good, good prices. Uh, similar to like what you would get at like a quick service. So a good brunch. It wasn't crowded, and I love old QS, I'm not gonna lie. We've been looking at DVC now <laughs> because I love that resort. And we don't really know how DVC works. We've looked into it so many times and we just don't understand how it's worth it. But we're gonna look into it again. I'm not sure. But yeah, now we're just back at the resort and hanging out. It's very crowded, so not our jam. Gonna just hang out together and see what the night brings us. We made it back to the room. We, it was crazy, so we came back. It was a little too crowded for us. The wait times were insane, and our rule was once it got crowded, we would leave and go back. So we just uh, came back, hung out in the lobby. The lobby was for check-in. We weren't by check-in. was insane. So a lot of people, it looks like maybe here for the weekend. Uh, horror night started, so I think a lot of people are all staying here because our uh, hotel pier 8 stays open now for horror nights either 2 to 3 a 3 a.m. for all the horror nights people. So we hung out in the lobby in the, our own section, check in like it was crazy, and we just ordered DoorDash. Uh, we um, got some Cheesecake Factory, it was delicious. And yes, now we're just back in the room. It's only 7.30 and we've been here, for, we've been watching, catching up on our shows that we've missed. Uh, the TV does have on demand, so like shows that you can watch. Uh, so yeah, just hanging out. It was an easy day, and so we'll see tomorrow. I think it's gonna be just as crazy, so don't know what's planned. We might not even attempt anything, uh, pull it, so might just be in a relaxing day. So with that in mind, bye everyone.